fitness pro Brendan J. Fox. Putting on the spot. Here we have Minnie Me. This is my little cousin Alex. Excellent. So, what were some of my findings? I mean, uh, if you remember, Mom. Just applied to regular, common, everyday exercises. A lot of these things you can do from home. That guy needs a haircut, by the way. I was just going to say, someone got <laughs> a haircut since haircut. they're. Uh... What I get people to do is crank up the incline on a treadmill. Perfect. And walk briskly. Take it up as high as it goes, and then just make speed the variable you control. And you can burn almost as many calories as running, but it's very low impact. Yes. And it really tones up the calves and butt muscles as well. Thank you so much. Let's talk about some other workouts yes. that we keep in mind. Yes. I, I like what you just said, though. I like what you just said. Say that one more time about take, you know, stiffening the muscles. Muscles, right? So you can't spot reduce the fat, but you, you can, can spot stiffen yeah. by exercising those areas Just in which you have the cellulite, you increase the tone of the underlying muscles right. and it helps to push the fat flat. It okay. retreats back from the connective tissue matrix yeah. so it's not pushing through and as if much. You remember that. You're prescribing stretches like you're prescribing a drug. If you prescribe the wrong stretch, you can get a bad side effect. Right. There's a difference between a muscle that's short and tight and long and tight. Right. Okay. So what happens is if you imagine that this is a joint, my two fists are a joint, and the elastic in between is the muscles, mm -hmm. then what happens is, you know, if that joint becomes loose and compromised, the elastic or muscles may be tight, and people would assume you stretch it out. Right. So, because it's a tight muscle, but what happens is if you stretch that out, you give more momentum to that joint to become looser, and so that could, that's how stretching can create a bigger problem. Maybe it's just that I'm old. Maybe. Maybe, maybe it's just that attitude. <laughs> maybe it's just that. If you are a senior citizen, they did do a study at McMaster University. Yeah. They took people 70 years of age, uh -huh. and they had them do weight training twice a week for a period of six months. Okay. And what they found, that these people doing weights twice a week for six months, they reversed the cellular age of their muscles by 35 to 40 years. Oh, they wow. had the strength, energy, and metabolism of people about 25 to 30 years old. Unbelievable. And that, so literally they're showing that at any age with the proper forms of exercise, you can sure. rapidly turn around the that age of muscles. great. One, two, three, first forever, and he's never.